Award-winning poet and playwright, Mick Flynn, co-author of A Note Slipped Under the Door, is getting a lot of attention lately. His memoir describing his chance reunion with his estranged father is the basis of the new film Being Flynn, starring Robert De Niro and Paul Dano. We recently spoke with him via telephone about his time in the New York City public school system teaching poetry to children, and how through poetry, students can begin to construct their own understanding of their world. You know, I worked in New York City classrooms uh, for seven years uh, uh, after I finished grad school, or even while I was in grad school in New York at NYU studying poetry. And uh, some of the poems that, that, you know, that I used, you know, we tried to find poems that would work with younger people. Uh, you know, most of these poems were sort of more image-based, uh, probably sort of, you know, uh, accessible in some way. Uh, yet, you know, I, I never wanted to... Uh, I never, I never wanted to talk down to the to the young writers, you know, to to, to give them something that was just uh, uh, easy, you know. I, I wanted I wanted the poems to be, you know, engaging in some way and challenging. So, and, and, you know, fortunately, there's a lot of poetry like that that uh, that one can use. We used I, I, I like using a lot of Lucille Clifton's work, uh, Naomi Shihab Nye's work, uh, also a poet um, William Stafford. Uh, he has a poem called A Story. That could be true, uh, which I, I found really very moving for myself. I, I would actually be very moved reading it to these students, and they would always get moved. It was about a um, uh, this sort of fantasy about uh, if you were uh, if you were raised in a if you were raised in the forest, if you were if you, if you somehow about missing your parents and being raised by like uh, being raised alone in the world, and then you just imagine who your parents are, uh, and then it was always uh, very successful to read that to, to groups of young people, in, you know, in the various New York City, New York City schools, uh, you know, a lot of whom were raised without, you know, two parents. And somehow that would sort of perk them up and they would sort of start to pay attention in a way that seemed to be the first thing that we needed to do to get poets engaged, to send poets engaged. Most of the students would not consider themselves to be writers. Uh, their own writing hadn't necessarily been honored, uh, you know, b before. Uh, they were sort of meant to write uh, what was expected of them, sort of what was required for the class. So, so writing was, you know, not a, not a, a process of sort of delving into the, the, the deeper um, truths of the self, but just repeating back what, what had been told to them. And so, you know, going into a classroom and teaching poetry to young people, it, it's, it's, it can be a very radical act. It can actually, you know, open them up to think in a way, to think and to realize that they can actually make meaning of the world, of their own world that's around them in a way that maybe they hadn't had access to before. Uh, I found it very, uh, extremely engaging and uh, it, it, an exciting venture to, to get to, to share that with young people. A Note Slipped Under the Door, Teaching from Poems We Love, by Nick Flynn and Shirley McPhillips, is available online at www.stenhouse.com and through your Stenhouse distributor. Thanks for listening.